I'm Stephanie Hendrickson with Additive Manufacturing Media here at PT Expo 2025 in Rosemont, Illinois, and I'm standing in the Exact Metal booth. Exact Metal provides a low cost, small size, uh, compact enough to fit through a doorway laser powder bed fusion system. And one of the main applications that they see for this technology is making mold inserts. One of the challenges with 3D printing tooling like this thus far though has been in the material space. Materials like miraging steel can make a viable injection mold, but they are prone to corrosion. So if you want to use some of the most advanced capabilities of additive manufacturing, like conformal cooling channels for instance, your mold might have a lifespan on it. It might become too corroded inside of those channels to continue to be used at some point in its lifespan. One of the materials that Exact Metal um, uses and recommends to its customers is Corax from Udohol. This is a corrosion resistant tool and mold seal that is commonly used to machine tools but now is offered as a powder format as well for laser powder bed fusion. The advantage of using this material is that it is resistant to that corrosion, can provide longer lasting mold tools, and help molders achieve better results with their 3D printed tools. So how is this material in combination with laser powder bed fusion being used? We have some parts here built by Zero Tolerance, a user of the Exact Metal platform. Um, so this part is a component for a sprinkler system. This is a, a cap that frequently gets run over by lawnmowers, so people need replacements of these. And this 3D printed um, tool is used to make this part. Uh, this is the assembled version. But inside, this tool has all of these conformal cooling channels. The reason that you would want to use 3D printing, or one of the reasons you would want to use 3D printing to build an injection mold tool for a part like this in the first place. Uh, before incorporating these cooling channels, this mold had a cycle time of about 52 seconds. With this addition, with these features and the cooling possible, uh, they reduced the cycle time down to 42 seconds, and they believe it's possible to reduce it even further down to 40 seconds with process optimization in the presses itself. One other possibility that this material makes practical is porous tools. So this is a 3D printed insert that has uh, porosity built right in uh, using the parameters inside of the machine. This is something that can be used for venting molds, uh, but the challenges with doing this with something like miraging steel is that, uh, again, you might need to use water to clean this out. You might be using water as part of the venting and you can get rust, you can get um, clogging. And so using the Corax material provides a corrosion resistant solution that allows uh, porosity like this to remain clean, remain usable for the life of the mold. If you want to learn more about 3D printing for mold tooling, visit additivemanufacturing.media. We've got an entire zone all about uh, 3D printing for tooling. You can also follow our sister publication, Mold Making Technology, over at moldmakingtechnology.com. Thanks for watching.